and it's pos and you know <clears throat> Okay, I don't know at what point was this stopped. My my thing stopped and started again. It's possible that Brett could have been hit by a car accidentally, but that's not what happened. And I think I've sh I think that just, just I, evidence is piling, piling, piling up to show that that's the case. There's just no way you can really make that argument if you sit there and look at all the evidence. Um, the problem is, or you know, I don't know if it's a problem, but it's the situation is that if you actually figure it out, you see that there, it's not the situation where one person decided to kill another person, uh, as a rogue act, but that, you know, it was a, um, process that happened with a lot of people being involved. And, um, my guess is that enough people involved with, you know, in important places were part of it that, you know, there's just no way it's ever going to get past a per certain point as far as anybody, you know, going through, normal systems of, of accountability. But what that does then is it sets up this precedent of something being too outside the norm to um, deal with through the system. And maybe it makes people think that they can just get away with stuff as long as they, you know, do it in the right way, which, you know, at times in this case ends up being a very big crime, but you're working very hard to keep people, um, silent by manipulating systems of power, including the medical industry, including the court systems and things like that by ma manipulating powerful people within these systems and so forth. And lots and lots and lots of techniques going on at once. So anyway, like I was saying, I didn't know that this wasn't an unfortunate accident. And I didn't know that this wasn't an unfortunate accident. Um, but that's not, and that's not what they were. So, um, the next dream in the, in this list then after those two is this blue face woman dream. This is when Brooke and I both have a nightmare at the same time. And Brooke at this point is what? Five months old, five months old. She has a nightmare and I have a nightmare at the same time. So what that says to me is she's already being beamed at age five months. That doesn't surprise me at all. I mean, from what I remember of my own childhood. So, um, three knitting needles on this mattress and fish are three fish apparently are skewered on them. So in the dream I had a few nights ago, there's, I remember there's three fish-like creatures coming across the floor and there's some sort of link to the Burke Museum. I ended up looking up the Burke Museum later and a couple days after I had that dream. In fact, I think today they're having a, uh, some sort of reopening or grand opening and there is something with them linked to whales. Um, or at least they mentioned something in some of their publications material, something about whales. Um... So why is it three fish? Is it just three fish because of the number three and the empress and the empress being linked to certain entities? That might be it. Or it might be there are three severe cases going on that are explosive. And what are they? I know bread is one of them. There's no doubt in my mind that bread is one of them. I think I know what the other two are, but I don't know yet for sure that I know what they are. Probably... If I need to know, I'll probably know real soon. But I think that they're, you know, I mean, the first thing that comes to mind, I'll just say the first thing that comes to mind, okay, is, um, well, oh, there's so many that there, there could be, you know. It could be Kurt Cobain. It could be 9-11. It could be the fish kill. Um, it could be um, Frank and Sherry's kids, their three oldest children who I know were all assassinated. So if every symbol has three meanings, it could be all of those things at the same time. I should try to think positive thoughts because I can see Brooke picks up on my vibrations. And I draw two pictures of my daughter here in her baby basket. So this is me doing drawing from, you know, looking at my daughter and drawing her picture. That's what she looked like when I had that dream. 
And when she also had a dream, you know, a nightmare beam to her, that's how old she was.